What's up you guys? My name is Khalid Stallings and welcome back to another episode of Amori. Now, in the last episode, we woke up in Akuji's room. We hung out with the homie Kyo and uh, did a few errands, picked out some food because Hero was coming back. And uh, it's a good thing he did come back because if he didn't, I probably would have died. And Basil would have also died. And uh, yeah, that would have been bad on everyone's health, mentally. But uh, yeah, if you haven't seen that episode, feel free to check it out. I will leave it linked. There is also a playlist I will leave linked in the description. Be sure to check that out. Get caught up to speed with the rest of us. But if you are caught up to speed, then you don't have to worry about all that. Now, we saved Basil from drowning and he's still knocked out and we're getting ready to check on him. Now hopefully he's okay. Hey Kel. Hey Kuji. Looks like Basil's gonna be just fine. That's reassuring. I heard from mom that Basil was missing and that you two were, went looking for him. When I was running around the park, I heard some commotion coming from the other hangout spot. Or coming from our hangout spot. I guess I got there right in the nick of time. You sure did. So, what was happening back there? Aubrey, she pushed Basil into the lake. What? That was Aubrey back there? No way, she wouldn't do that to Basil. I'm sure there was some kind of misunderstanding. She's not the same anymore, Hero. She's become all messed up after you left for college. Aubrey. What happened while I was gone? Maybe I should have never left. It's not your fault that this happened. Things could have gotten a lot worse if you didn't show up. You've done all you can. Come on, let's go home. Hey, heroes in the party. Wait, can we check on Basil? Okay, so Basil's still asleep. Oh, Akuji, there's no way out of this, is there? What? Or Basil's been oh wait poor basil's been through so much these past few days basil you must be tired please get some rest we'll come back for you tomorrow take care of him polly i've been taking care of basil for two years already but i barely know anything about him i wish he would open up about himself more i just want to help well that's the thing about help can't force it, otherwise you'll be hurting them. Hey, Basil's grandma. Oh, is she speaking? Basil, is that you? Uh, no, but, I mean, I'm here to listen if you want to say anything. Alright, I guess she's not much of a talker, it's okay. Let's go to the bathroom real quick. Yep, still cute though. All right, let's leave. Let's go back to their house. You know, Kuji, you were pretty awesome back there. Jumping into the lake to save Basil like that? Even if Hira ended up saving the day, I think you deserve some recognition too. Yeah. Badge of honor. How about a high five? Bro, you know I'm not gonna pass up a chance to high five Kel. Why is that even an option? It's an automatic yes. Alright, bro. Let's do this. Now, there is... I think I can go into the other people's houses that I helped. But I don't think they live on this block. Oh, it's a coin. 
found a coin. What do I use those coins for, though? Okay, so I think that's it. Let's go to their house. Oh my god, is this where he lives? What are you doing? I'm sensing an evil presence coming from inside my house. Maybe I'm overthinking it. But I can never be too careful. Get the scouter, bro. Check the power level before you go inside. You might be in for more than you can handle. Oh, wait, this is their house, right. Alright, you wanna meet the dog? What's up with the house? Why is it sparkly? You wanna- Yes! Oh, can I throw it? Oh, I guess I can't throw it. Okay. Well, alright. I got my hopes up a little bit. Alright. We'll play with Hector some other time. This music is fire. Kev? Hero? Where have you two been? It's so late, I've been worried sick. Sorry, Mom. We got held up. But the good news is, we found Basil, and he's safe. Hmm. I have, you know, I spent all week preparing a roast chicken for tonight's dinner. And... It's gotten cold. No, not the cold roast. Mom, please don't cry. Don't worry, Mom. That's what microwaves are for, bro. It's not the same. It's not the same. Oh, my poor dinner. There, there, honey. Cheer up. Tonight's... Today's a special day. There's no need to be sad. Look, Hero's back from college. And it's good to see you back, champ. Thanks, Dad. Oh, your dad is right. This is no time for sniffles. It's good to see you back, Hero. We've all missed you so much. What the heck was that? Where are? Oh, Sally. Oh, it sounds like Sally's awake. I'll go get her. Come on, boys. You must be hungry. Go on and help yourselves to dinner. Cool. Let's grab some food and heat it up. That sounds like a plan. Yeah. Oh, man. This thing is huge. Can I sit? How do I sit down? I offered to help your mom. Oh, I offered to help your mom cook for dinner tonight, but you know how she is in the kitchen. Make sure to tell her how good her food is. How do I sit down? Oh, wait, I have to grab a plate. Oh, okay, so maybe we grab a plate from in here. Salt and pepper shakers, okay. What do I do? How do I sit down? Oh my god, am I really having trouble sitting down? I got a home cooked meal, but it's cold. Oh, I have to heat it up. Okay. You. Now that everything's calmed down, we can finally relax a bit. It's good to see you again, Ikuji. Likewise, dude. It really has been way too long. Oh, and it's good to see you too, Kel. So, Ikuji, I heard from Mom that you're moving away soon. It sounds so exciting. Yeah, he is. 
Tomorrow's gonna be his last day with us. Moving might seem kind of nerve-wracking now, but it really isn't so bad once you get used to it. I think it would be good for you, Akuji. You learn a lot moving to a new place, and it's nice to have a fresh new start. I'm a little sad to see you go, but it'll be okay as long as we keep in touch. Yeah, <sighs> We sure did have a lot of memories together. Sometimes I miss those days. Lazing around, eating food, drinking juice, and spilling juice for some of us. Yeah, we did everything together. We went to the park, the lake, the beach. But honestly, I miss the most hanging out at your place, Akuji. You guys had everything. The big TV, all the newest toys, the grand piano. And of course, our very own treehouse. Oh yeah, the treehouse is awesome. I wonder if it's still there. Is it Akuji? Uh, your guess is as good as mine. I haven't been outside in years. Looks like the food's done. Let's eat it in the living room. We can continue chatting there. Alright, let's bring it in there. We don't need plates, we got hands. By the way, Hero. Basil gave Akuji his photo album yesterday. Did you want to see it? Do you have Basil's photo album on you? Sure, let's look through the album while we eat dinner. Alright. Are there any new pictures that have been added? Or is he going to comment on some of them? Do you have a comment for this one, Hero? Would you like to explain yourself? Kel was still feeling a little sour after losing to Hero in arm wrestling last night, so Hero decided to lean in for a smooch. Kel looks so annoying. Ah, brotherly love. Yup. It's brotherly love for you. Okay, so I don't think any of the pictures have changed. Okay, everything looks to be the same. Yeah, I think I'm done looking at the photo album. Wait, what? Yeah, I'm done looking at it. Too bad that some photos are missing. Aubrey stole the photo album from Basil, but we got it back. Maybe she has the rest of the photos. Hmm. H hey, Hero, what's up? Are you okay? Yeah. I just... It's just... Well... Mari isn't in any of these pictures. Oh, you're right, she isn't. Still, this album really brings back some good memories. Things we were a lot simpler when we were all kids. Akuji, I have a favor to ask. Do you think you could let us see your house one more time before you leave? Oh, that's a good idea. But you gotta convince his mom first. She's probably going to be kind of mad about you not spending enough time with her and stuff. You know how she is. We are. I'm trying to... It sounds like a fucking Skrillex effect. Oh, she brought a baby in here. You. What a mess that was. Sally made a little doo-doo, but she's all clean now. Hui. Ubu. You're speaking my language, Sally. Hey there, Sally. Peekaboo. <laughs> Stop it, Kel. You're scaring her. Ahem. So, 
Uh, hey, Mom. We were wondering if we could go and hang out at Coochie's house today, since he's moving away soon. Oh? But you just came back. And it's already so late. What about spending time with your mom? I'm going to be here for the rest of the summer, and Akuji's leaving the day after tomorrow. We have plenty of time to catch up. I think it's okay for Hiro to spend some time with Kel and Akuji. I haven't seen Akuji around for a long time now. It's been a while since the boys had the chance to hang out. I say we let them. Hmm. Fine then. You boys can have your fun. But Hiro has to wash the dishes with me for the next week. Sure. I guess I can do that. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, you're free to go. Come on, Sally. Let's leave your mean old brothers alone. They don't want anything to do with us, do they, Sally? No, they don't. Oh, Mom. Hey, your pops is cool. Can we talk to him? Don't fret about your mom too much, Hiro. She just messes. She just misses you, that's all. She'll feel better after she calms down. You guys go off and do your thing. I'll make sure she's okay. All right. Hey, party at my house. Oh, wait, we're not old enough to drink. Okay. But Hiro is. Hey. So, I'm really glad that we get to hang out and everything. But I also feel pretty bad for leaving Mom all alone. Before we head to your house, let's go to fix it and get some flowers for her. I know she'd really appreciate that. Oh, Hiro. Always a mama's boy. Hey, listen. You treat your mama right. That's the most important woman in your life before you get married. Empty pit in the basket. We like to save. Yeah, let's save. Uh, save it. Save it. Save it. All right. Now, let's head to Fix It Felix's shop of fixing stuff. I'm continuing the sentence way too long. All right. Is there anything still in the park? Okay, so there's a cat here. Meow. Alright. Bro, can you... Wait, who's that? Pretty boy. Life's been kind of stressful lately, but people watching here makes me... I might make a habit to come to part more. Okay, yeah, we talked to him before. Alright, let's go to fix it. I get the feeling we might run into Aubrey or something. Old man with glasses. I'm meeting up with someone, but they're late. Don't tell me I've been stood up. Oh, you're on a date? Dang. He old, but he still got it. Fix it. Fix it. Fix it. Uh, fix it. Fix it. I don't know why I started doing that. Okay. Oh, this is that one girl. Minty is diligently sketching away. Oh, she's drawing flowers. So what flowers do I get? Uh, let's... Flowers. Okay, what flowers should I get her, though? I feel like we should ask someone... Sometimes I come here to look at the flowers. I think we're getting flowers a few for the house, but I've heard that some plants attract the ants. Ants are the bane of my existence. The last thing I want are ants crawling around my house. Same. I mean, I don't hate ants. I don't want them crawling around the house, though. Okay, so where do I get flowers from? Oh, you know what? Maybe I have to just go to the counter. A money machine. I'm gonna fix it where you can buy stuff and fix it yourself. Bye. Oops. Before I forget, Akuji, here's some money for mom's flowers. You didn't think I'd let you pay for it, did you? 
Oh, I didn't even think about that. Got ten dollars from Hero. Wow. Oh wow. They only cost two dollars and he gave me ten. Yo, Hero is the fucking realist. Mom's gonna love these flowers. Let's drop them off at my place, Akuji. You got it, dude. Dang, he's smart, he's attractive. He's a good guy. I'm pretty sure he's got problems of his own, but you know what? Hey, he is working on them. And if he ain't solved it, then he close. Okay, so, wait, is this their, no, it's not, it's this one. Let's leave them here. Hmm, looks like it's getting pretty late. We should probably head to your house right after this. Sound good to you? Yeah, let's do that. Where do I leave the flowers at? Can I go in their parents' room? <laughs> hey mom, I got you some flowers. Oh, are these for me? They're beautiful. Thank you. Hero, you're such a charmer. Just like your old man. I'm sorry for overreacting earlier. I know Akuji is moving away soon. Try your best to keep in touch. Friends are harder to make the older you get. Mom, that's so depressing. We'll be fine. Yes, I'm sure you will be. Take care, Akuji. Know that you'll always have a home here. Oh, that was sweet. Can I speak to the baby? Although I don't imagine the baby has much to say. Alright, let's just leave. Let's go back to his house. Or my house, actually. Oh, man, it's dark out here. Yep, let's hurry up and get in the house. Wow, it just hit me. It's been so long since we've been inside your house, even though we live right next door. Time really flies, huh? Yeah, it sure does. Let's go inside. After you, Akuji. Oh god, please excuse the spiders. If you see any giant black widows, just uh, step on them. Or yell at them, they might run away. Whoa, this place is cleared out. Your house was a lot bigger now that there's nothing here. There used to be a couch here where we used to watch TV. We'd all come over every weekend and watch cartoons in the morning. Oh, just like in the book. So those were his memories. Yeah, and this is a stain on the floor from the time I spilled my orange juice. Thought it was apple juice. Mari got so mad at me. Well, it's because her cat stepped in and then walked all over the house. Heh. <laughs> oh, yeah, huh. Oh, man. Looks like it's getting too dark to go see the treehouse. Hey, that's okay. Maybe we can come back tomorrow. Wait, I have an idea. What if we just stay over here for the night? It's gonna be our last time in this house forever, right? And when will be the next time we could spend the night with a Kuji like this? I'd love to, but Mom's not gonna be too happy about it. She'll be fine. 
I'm tired of waking up at night because of Sally's crying anyway. You're gonna wash dishes with mom for an entire week, aren't you? You deserve this. Well, that's true. It'll probably be fine. We live right next door, so we'll only be a walk away. Yeah, he'll be fine. I've got knives here for everyone. If you meet any giant monsters going up the steps, just get one out of the drawer. Okay, so we already ate, so we should be fine. Yeah, I don't think there's anything in this house to see. Let's go on upstairs. Ah, I remember this hallway. The closet was to the left. And the piano was to the right. I wonder if the piano is still here. I'll go on ahead and see. Oh, can we go in there and see? Is it still here? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that's cool. Why didn't I check this out before? Don't judge me too hard. I haven't practiced in a while. And then he fucking plays Mozart. <laughs> Show off. <laughs> I guess I still got it. You're telling me. Hey, Kuji, that reminds me. Do you still play the violin? Uh, I haven't played violin in a while, though. Oh, it's not here. I guess you already packed it up. There was this song you used to play with Mari. It still gets stuck in my head sometimes, but I don't remember what it's called. You two would play it over and over. We'd even hear it from our house sometimes. What was it again? Uh, my memory is very, very bad, Hero. I do not know what that song is called. <sighs> Man, all of a sudden I'm getting really sleepy. Maybe we should call in a night. Yeah, maybe it's because we got our fucking ass kicked by six people. That sounds good to me. I have to get up early for my morning jog anyway. So, where should we sleep, Akuji? Probably somewhere in your room, right? I remember you used to hate sleeping alone. Yeah, that sounds fun. We can sleep on the floor if anything. Wait, we can sleep on the floor if anything? Let's go find some blankets. Hold on, Kyo, wait. Alright, let's look through some of these boxes and find some blankets. Please don't let there be anything on the way upstairs. Oh. That's the song. What do you mean? Mari's in there right now playing that. Oh my god. I might have to learn this song on piano. I'm not going to lie to you. Oh, it's so beautiful. But that explains why Mario was in white space. Oh, no. Actually, that's the opening song. Yes. Hey, Kuzi, we built a bed for it. I hope you don't mind. Dang, that was quick. This was all Kel's idea. I had nothing to do with it. By the way, Hiro, Kuji and I got a gift for you. Kel gave Hiro's gift to Hiro. This is Papa Chip's chip off the old block cookbook. Do you remember this? Of course I do. Man, I remember when I wanted to be a cook. I used to also want to be a cook. It seems so silly now. Cooking is a lifetime skill. Hey. You were pretty good at it. You can still be a cook, Hiro. Ah. It's okay. I don't have time for that anymore. But, you really like to cook, don't you? And people have to eat, right? So, like, why not? Hmm. 
I don't think it works that way, Kel. Oh snap, he's asleep. Dang, that was quick. <laughs> he's such a fast sleeper. Always been that way, I guess. Lucky. Thanks for letting us sleep over, Kuji. I bet it's been pretty hard in this empty house, especially without Mari. I'm sorry I couldn't be there for you more. Everything feels so different now. But it seems like you're pretty much stay the same. It's kind of relieving to be honest. It's really nice to see you again. I just wish Aubrey and Basil could be here too. Uh, anyway. Sorry for ranting. It's getting late. I'll probably head to sleep soon. Good night, Akuji. I'll talk to you in the morning. Night, bro. Let me just go ahead and lay in the bed. Very comfortable bed. I would like to go to sleep, yes. You know, this night I might actually be able to sleep in peace. You know, the homies are here. Now, unless there's a spider in the corner, but I don't, I'm not afraid of spiders anymore. Whoa, what was that? That was crazy. And where are they at? Okay, so I think I was right. I think this is just a dream world. But I'm going to call that an episode for today. I want to thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And uh, yeah, this really does expand a lot of the theories that I had before. And you're free to leave theories down in the comments too as to what's happening because I don't know what's going on, but I have a feeling that we're getting close to figuring out some answers. But uh, yeah, there's a playlist. I will link it in the description once again if you want to check out the rest of the episodes. And uh, yeah, this cat is very, very uh, creepy and it just follows you everywhere. You know what? It's not that creepy. He's got a little derpy grin, yeah. but I guess that's not creepy. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching these videos. I'll talk to you all in the next one.